Hey guys, Corey with Palmetto Battery Pros, and today we're gonna to be doing an unboxing video of the Bolt Energy 51 volt, 105 amp hour lithium golf cart battery. And in this video, we're gonna discuss how this product ships. We're gonna discuss the battery specs. We're gonna discuss the installation bundle, and we will briefly discuss how to mount this battery into your cart. Once you order your Bolt Energy battery, now the product will ship in two boxes. The first box is a hazmat labeled wooden box. It's pretty secure, comes on its own little pallet, and that has your battery inside. And the cardboard box will have everything that's included in the installation kit. We're gonna go ahead and open up the battery box first. And to do that, we're going to pry these tabs up here, 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 and we're gonna kind of disassemble this box. Once you pop the lid on the battery box, you will find that the battery is pretty well encased inside of the box with styrofoam, some thick cardboard, it's banded nicely. So next you will go ahead and pop the bottom tabs and this will expose the battery and we'll, we'll go ahead and get it out. Once you have the box disassembled, go ahead and remove the four mounting screws. They are Phillips head and uh, go ahead and take the bands off and everything and get the battery exposed. All right, now that we have the battery out and on the table, let's go ahead and discuss the battery specs and the battery itself. This is a single unit drop-in lithium battery for golf carts. It is 51 volts, 105 amp hours. It has a 500 amp max output for 30 seconds and a continuous discharge rate of 250 amps. This battery comes in a powder coated steel shell. It has handles on the top. It has the main positive terminal, your main negative terminal, it has a Bluetooth connection. Uh, they display this for your dash mounted voltage meter wiring harness. And it also has a CAN bus communication port as well as an on off button. And it's recommended that if you know you're gonna leave this cart sitting for more than a week, to go ahead and shut the battery off. This battery weighs 104 pounds. The dimensions of this battery is 17.6 inches long, 12.17 inches wide, and 11.22 inches tall. The Bolt Energy battery will max charge up to 58 volts and then when you unhook your charger, it'll fall down to its resting voltage, somewhere in the high 53 volt range. And you will use this battery from 53, 53.2 volts down to, I would say I usually try to charge around 50 volts, but you could run it down as low as 48. But again, go off your dash mounted voltage meter, which we'll discuss here in a minute. Okay, so I've gone ahead and opened the installation kit box. I, I went ahead and took all the uh, peanut uh, styrofoam pieces out uh, so it's less of a mess here. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and pull everything that's in the installation kit out and we'll discuss. It is a bit like Christmas Day opening up that box. There are so many cool little bolt boxes in there with all the accessories that you need to install this battery into your cart. So I'll go through everything as quickly as possible. And then after that, I'll show you how everything kind of hooks up to the battery. First, we'll discuss the manuals that come with the installation kit. And Bolt has done an amazing job of putting together a really nice user manual. So, um, and, and just guides. And so we'll just run through them real quick. Uh, of course, it comes with the operation manual here. You have your state of charge meter installation guide right there. It comes with the, uh, you'll find in the mounting bracket kits, there are installation guides or installation instructions. So they're pretty detailed and will answer any questions you may have during your installation. The 15 amp charge receptacle replacement, AC port comes with a user manual as well as the onboard charger and the 12 volt reducer. I really like that Bolt includes stickers in their installation kit. First, we're gonna discuss the dash mounted voltage meter. And uh, it looks kind of weird on video. It doesn't look like that in person. 
but you'll see the, the top number is your voltage and it shows voltage under load. The second number is your usable capacity and the bottom number is the amp draw. So you can see how many amps are being pulled out of your battery when you're operating the car. It hooks to the battery via the display port and the Bluetooth port has a wiring harness and it goes to this little Bluetooth adapter. Here are the mounting brackets that you'll use and there's several different types and depending on which cart type you own, Bolt will send you the correct mounting brackets. Hardware. This is the 15 amp AC port and it's going to be a 110 male, pour, or male plug here. So you'll just run a, an extension cord that can handle at least 15 amps. This is the onboard charger. It is a 15 amp charger. Here is your output wire, which hooks to your uh, eyelets here. So these are gonna connect right there, and then you're gonna put your eyelets to your battery. Extra long cord. Included is the 12 volt reducer, so 48 volts. There's only 48 volts at the terminals. So for all your 12 volt accessories, we're gonna need to lower that voltage down to 12 volts. Uh, so Bolt does provide the 12 volt reducer. It is a 30 amp reducer, and it has inline fuses to protect the, the uh, reducer and also the wiring harness here. So it's gonna plug in here and these are gonna be your input and output wires. I'll discuss that here in a second as well. Bolt also includes in their installation kit uh, eyelets and these eyelets are gonna be for the 12 volt reducer. Okay, lastly, heavy duty solenoid replacement. It is a 400 amp solenoid, 48 volt. It includes two gauge cables, main positive and negative cables. So if yours are old and corroded, this is a, a really good touch. You don't have to worry about it. You just swap them out. Zip ties for some wire management. And lastly, a really good touch is the lead acid battery puller. So if you've ever pulled lead acid batteries without a set of pullers, you'll know that it's uh, not very fun. Okay, so I've kind of uh, kind of put everything together, how it would be set up in the cart. And I'm briefly gonna run through it. Your new negative two gauge cable is gonna run to your controller your two gauge positive is going to run to your replacement solenoid. Next we have our battery connection piece to our charger. And I went ahead and plugged that into the charger output wire. And then the charger input wire, I went ahead and hooked up the long cable here and then hooked it up to my AC port, which is gonna come around and be my plug there. And lastly, we have our 12 volt reducer. I went ahead and plugged the wiring harness in. And just real quick, this runs to your key switch. The red is your 12 volt supply. The blue is your constant. And the black and yellow is your 48 volt input supply. So we'll take these two, put eyelets on them, the eyelets that are provided in the kit, and we'll put those to our positive and negative posts on our battery. So now we'll discuss mounting this battery and Bolt provides the mounting brackets. And there's a, several different types. There's a universal, there's a club car, there's a TXT, uh, but Bolt will send you the correct one. And it makes installing the uh, battery just super simple. So basically you're gonna just insert the brackets into the right position using the mounting hardware. You'll secure it down to your existing battery tray and these holes line up perfectly with the feet on the battery and you're just going to set it down into place and go ahead and bolt the battery down and from there you're just going to go ahead and hook the rest of the battery up and you pretty much be done all right in regards to mounting the uh dash mounted voltage meter it comes with instructions here and a little template that you can use to draw your circle if you need to, or you can use a two inch hole saw, slide your voltage meter in place and secure it to the back with the mounting bracket and hardware provided. All right guys, that's it for the Bolt Energy 51 volt, 105 amp hour unboxing video. I hope this video helped and answered uh, most of your questions. If you have any additional questions, please leave them in the comments below. I do my best to answer those as quickly as possible. You can also call me directly during business hours, nine to five weekdays. 
at Palmetto Battery Pros. I'd be happy to answer any questions you may have. Also, we have these batteries for sale. Uh, we ship and have them in stock in store. So if you'd like to purchase one of these batteries, you can do it by phone or online on our website. And also, if we missed anything, missed any information, please leave that in the comments below. We are constantly learning about these products and uh, yeah, we welcome any feedback. And please hit that subscribe and like button we have more lithium unboxing videos and installation videos coming out. We're also going to be reviewing different types of product for different types of applications. So yeah, we look forward to seeing you next time.